The Buffalo Bills are releasing former All-Pro safety Jordan Poyer, and with the move, they'll free up approximately $7.5 million in cap space. Poyer was set to become a free agent at the end of the 2024 season, but he hits free agency early and will become one of the top free agent safety options on the market. Welcome back to the Bills Bunker. I'm Jake Varco, and this is a bit of a surprise. I mean, we knew that the Bills were going to have to save some money. Jordan Poyer being released. These are the kind of tough decisions that this team is going to have to make. One of those cornerstone pieces of this team for the last seven years since being acquired by Brandon Bean. Captain of the team, a leader on this defense, no longer. If you haven't yet, I encourage you to subscribe to the channel. Stay tuned for more content coming your way. I just... I was in the gym and I got the I got the alert on my phone that Poyer was released. I raced home, stopped my workout because I'm that dedicated to bringing you content. If that's not worth a subscription, I don't know what is. Wow, Jordan Poyer has officially been released by the Buffalo Bills and this comes ahead of the 2024 free agency period opening on March 13th and we all know that Micah Hyde likely not returning to the Buffalo Bills. Now Jordan Poyer not returning to the Buffalo Bills. This safety tandem has been one of the best in the National Football League over the last seven years in Buffalo. And now the Bills have some massive holes to fill on that defense, especially in that secondary. The Bills also announced that they had restructured the contract of Rasul Douglas and that they're releasing Saran Neal. I'll make separate videos about those. You can stay tuned for that. On this channel but right now Jordan Poyer being released this is a this is a tough one for Bills Mafia to swallow because Poyer he was a fan favorite in Buffalo a leader of that defense and I remember at that Chiefs game Poyer made some big time plays and some big big time moments for this Bills team uh, obviously on the goal line forcing that fumble that was a huge play give the ball Bills the ball back and ha give them an opportunity to go ahead and win the ball game on that final drive. Didn't end the way they wanted it to, but Jordan Poyer, that's a tough way for him to end his Bills career. Poyer is a 32-year-old safety who has been an integral piece of the Buffalo Bills over the last seven years with the team, and this one is an actual shocker because we, we knew that this team was going to move on from pieces. We knew that they were going to have to make some tough decisions in cutting players, but I don't think anyone really truly expected Jordan Poyer to be one of the candidates to be released by this team. But it's a tough decision that had to be made. And it's one that a lot of people are going to disagree with. But at 32 years old, with one year left on his contract, the Bills, they're looking at an infusion of youth through the draft and through free agency. It's a decision that had to be made. Clearing $7.5 million in cap space and this allows them to make some moves in free agency through the draft and potentially make some more trades. Poyer blessed Bills Mafia with so many great memories and being a leader of the team for quite some time, I mean, he, he was truly a fan favorite here in Buffalo and his time in Buffalo, it's not going to be forgotten anytime soon. He's always welcome back to Buffalo and I'm sure wherever he goes, his first game back at Highmark Stadium, this guy, he's going to get an ovation. Bills Mafia loves Jordan Poyer, and it's tough to see him go. But that's that's this industry. That It's a cutthroat industry. This is the type of decision that needs to be made in order for this Bills team to add that infusion of youth and to get stronger for years to come. In order to keep the Bills Super Bowl window open with Josh Allen at quarterback, you need to cut some of the older guys and do what the Kansas City Chiefs are doing. Build through the draft. That way, you have a longer period of time to have that Super Bowl window open. It's just tough. It's tough to see Poyer go. Your captain on that defense, a true leader of this team. His time in Buffalo is officially over. But I want to know in the comments section down below, how are you feeling about this? I know there's going to be plenty of emotional Bills fans seeing this today. Let me know your thoughts in the comments section below. If you haven't yet, I encourage you to subscribe to the channel. Stay tuned for more content coming your way. And like I said, I have some other videos coming about coming out about Saran Neal and Rasul Douglas. Those will be released rather quickly. 
lots of stuff on my plate with this team right now. I'm going to try my best to get this out in a timely manner. So stay tuned. Thank you for watching the Bills Bunker. I'm Jake Varco. Go Bills. Thank you.